Virgo, welcome to Fantasy Lighthouse. We're going to be taking a look at what it is that you need to know to book a private session. All of that info can be found in the description box below of this video. Let's get started. Spirit, please provide me with messages for the sign of Virgo. Talk to me in reference to Virgo. What does Virgo need to know at this time? What does Virgo need to know, Spirit? What do you want Virgo to know? What else does Virgo need to know, please? What else does Virgo need to know? All right, so... For some reason, you know, there could be a fire sign around you an Aries, a Leo, or a Sagittarius, there's conflict with this person. I don't know if you're having a conflict with them, but I feel like they're having a conflict with themselves. Okay, so this is internal, what they're going through at this time. I feel like you're in this energy of working really hard on whatever it is that you are putting your energy into. Okay, you do want to participate you want to make something work is what i'm getting you want to come out of a dark place whatever that means to you all right i feel like you're healing you're coming out of healing actually and things are starting to get better okay i feel like you're moving along something very quickly something's happening really fast for you however Someone that you're dealing with continues to have some type of issue here. All right, we can clarify that. We have an energy here that is lonely, very emotional. I feel like at times they don't watch their words. They need to watch how they communicate is what I'm getting. They're trying to be strong about a particular situation. Let me clarify the five of wands. Spirit, please clarify the Five of Wands energy for Virgo. Clarify the Five of Wands, the Ace of Pentacles in reverse. And so they're telling me that you're not giving enough to them or they want more from you. Sometimes they believe in this. Sometimes they don't. Okay. It's like they're telling me that you don't want to participate with something, that you don't want to do something. I don't know what that is. Tell me more about the Ace of Pentacles in reverse here. Ace of Swords and the Queen of Pentacles. It's like they need to have a very serious talk with you, Virgo, is what I'm getting here. This person wants to have a serious sit down, like they need to talk to you about something and it's very important is what I'm getting here. They don't know if you wanna to talk to them or if you're going to reciprocate. There's something about this situation where they feel like you're gonna be turned off by it or something, but they're really serious is what I'm getting here. Somebody is. Tell me more. Tell me more. We have Libra, Gemini, Aquarius energy showing up here. If you're dealing with an air sign, this person, they're very wounded, they're hurt about something, and they've decided to retreat. Whoever it is that you're dealing with is very much in their feelings about something when it comes to you. They feel like they can't get through to you. I don't know if they lost you or if they feel like they're losing you, but... I feel like someone's very anxious about what you're up to, Virgo. They're not really speaking up about it, but they're thinking about coming forward. When they do, it's like this is a serious conversation that they want to have with you. You see, King of Swords, the Ace of Swords. It's like, I have to talk to you. I want to talk to you about something, Virgo. Like, this person wants to talk to you right now 
about this whole thing, even if they haven't come forward energetically. Someone who's silent wants to have this deep conversation about where the both of you are headed. Tell me more. It's someone that you already know, obviously. You know, this is someone that was really into you. Do you still think about the connection? Tell me more. Clarify the Six of Cups. This person, see, they feel like they can't have their way with you for some reason, is what I'm getting. Their energy is tired as well. It's very tired because I just sighed. So, you know, that's how they're feeling. They want a new beginning with you, but they feel like this is so difficult to do. And I don't know why. I don't know if they feel that you're being difficult or if it's difficult for them, but they feel like it's so challenging to have their way with you. Anything else? What is the future for Virgo and this person? You have, I mean, they're coming after you, Virgo. <laughs> so you got to prepare for it. Like this person is not going to let you go, especially if it's a fire sign, an Aries, a Leo, or a Sagittarius. If it's not a fire sign, it doesn't matter. The Knight of Wands is going to come and get what he wants, period. All right? So you're going to deal with somebody who's relentless here. This person wants to find justice in a situation with you, and that's what they want to talk to you about over here. All right, I see the tower there. It's like someone is going to win here at all costs. It's like they don't care what they have to risk. So be careful of that. Be mindful of that because the tower is here at the end. All right, that's what I have for you, Virgo. To book a private session, all of that info is below. Take care.